Everton and Arsenal play 1 0 today at as Goodison Park. It was Everton who took home the three points. Unfortunately for Arsenal, they couldn't even go back to Henry with, uh, a, with a point. It was quite unfortunate for them. It was Takovsky, Takovsky rather. Takovsky was the one that scored for Everton in the second half. Uh, to, you know, it happened lately. Uh, Lampard was sacked from uh, being an Everton coach. It was Sean Dishes, the former Burnley coach, who is now in charge at, uh, at Everton. It, the, the game plan was quite different from what Everton used to uh, play it was uh, a long range shot and uh, area ball that they used and defeating Hassena player. It was quite unfortunate, it wasn't what Hassena was expecting. The good news for Everton fans is that Everton got the three points they have been looking for, and uh, immediately after the match, they were able to escape uh, from the relegation zone. They are 17 at the, uh, at the table, 17 uh, at the table right now. And unfortunately for Hassana, Hassana uh, uh, before the match, they were 50 points uh, at the top of the table and um, with uh, a game in hand. And um, uh, the, the, the second place, which is Man City, was, uh, is, is having 45 points. And if Man City play tomorrow against uh, Tottenham and able to win that match, they will reduce the point to two points, which we man serious pressure on Arsenal would Arsenal be able to leave this trophy uh, after they won it last time in 2003? Where Arsenal will be able to do it? It seems Arsenal is becoming uh, the team is becoming shaky. What do you think, guys? Do you think Arsenal will be able to do something meaningful? But for Everton, I think F Everton will be able to avoid relegation in the remaining. Uh, <coughs> this season, Arsenal should. I mean, Everton should be able to avoid. Relegation, you know, Sean Dishit is uh, a very serious type of coach. I think it will do something meaningful for them.